Needle procedures are very common in clinical practice. Needles are used to access deep tissue structures, for example, to collect samples, to place catheters or to drain fluid, such as in abscesses. We typically rely on imaging for guiding the needle. However, this can become very difficult if the target is deeply located in the body. And so we are now starting a big research project together with a group from Poland. And we develop a system capturing vibrational information from the tip of the needle as the needle passes to different tissue structures. Our goal is to turn this information into a new source of real-time feedback supporting the radiologist doing the procedure and completing the existing imaging. We're presenting the Vipronav Viperacoustic Sensing and Navigation. And what we do here is we created a, a new sensor that we can attach to all kinds of interventional devices that help you measure the interaction between the needle tip or the device tip and the tissue that it penetrates for providing information about uh, tissue characteristics, temperature, and navigation info. And that could be a valuable additional tool for some clinical applications. And we're happy to do this and have the partner University Hospital Gießen here to work with us on this project. Our vision is to create a real-time audiohistology. So we analyze the signals to understand them and to discover patterns that go beyond the human perception. Bringing a system like this into clinical use means more than just building a prototype. It requires seamless integration into everyday workflows. That's only possible when engineers and clinicians work hand-in-hand, -hand, testing, refining and translating ideas into practical solutions. What makes our project so special is our team behind it. Young researchers, clinicians and engineers from two countries working together towards a shared goal and none of us could develop this technology alone. It's the interdisciplinary and intercultural collaboration that allows us to bridge the gap between medicine and engineering and to move innovations like Vipronav from the lab into clinical practice. We are at the beginning, but our goal is clear, to turn mechanical feedback into standardized diagnostic information for safer and more precise needle procedures.